Hey cuties, Peachy here. Welcome back to a new video. And in this video, oh my god, we have the full collection for the upcoming Barbie Extra Fly f sub sub theme, I guess, has been dropped, has been revealed from the five new regular size Barbie Extra dolls. We have Barbie Extra mini dolls, we have Barbie Extra mini minis, we have a playset. Oh my god. Okay, so let's let's get into it. So let's start <laughs> off with the regular size Barbie dolls. Here we have the first of the two beach themed dolls. So, so the over overall theme here is obviously fly, which is traveling. And so every doll has their own theme of like where they're traveling to. And so this doll, she's obviously beach themed. And then the other Ken doll is also beach themed. So these are two uh, dolls from the same theme, which is really cool because uh, they do fit. They're like they're they're like a pair, which I love. They kind of like they have the same prints, kind of like and the same color scheme, um, and it, it, it's really cute. So she has this huge like robe on, adorable. She has like this swimsuit on underneath. She has like a denim skirt on. The accessories, as you'll see, for all of these dolls, um, is plentiful. There's a ton of accessories. A huge bags like. That bag is enormous. It's almost the size of her entire body. So yeah, these bags are very, very large. <laughs> like very large <laughs> um and and i mean obviously i i hope you're able to put all the accessories in that bag because otherwise like why is it so big um yeah so the actual doll adorable i like the prints i like your face up i like the hair i like the hat i adore the shoes I like i love the shoes they're like translucent gummy looking pink um and yeah i don't know what else to say i think she's really adorable i think she she doesn't have a pink theme i think as we'll see again the other dolls they all kind of have a pink theme but her she's like the only one who's like really not pink at all so i think um that's very distinct to her um, and she she also has the deepest skin tone in the five regular size dolls as well so she's really cute i love her and she's also on a curvy barbie body um, and also the accessories uh as as you again as you'll also see for the other dolls they don't have pets so no pets included for this collection of barbie extra fly dolls no pets at all just accessories which to me I appreciate like I don't I don't use the pets and um, I much rather have more accessories that are cute for the dolls so uh, that's a very that's a very good step in the right direction I'm very I'm very surprised that Mattel decided to um, scrap the pets there's no pets so that's really cool. there's also this <laughs> cute picture with uh, the two beach theme dolls kind of like chilling next to each other on their towels so cute and so here is also Ken Ken as a Theme. He's wearing a set, uh, a shirt with a short set that has the matching print, um, and uh, it's very tropical looking. It's it's, and I do feel like he doesn't have a lot of pieces. Like it's just like two pieces, two outfit pieces, I believe. Um, but he does come with accessories, a lot of accessories. Again, plentiful. His bag is more uh, reasonably sized, thankfully. Um, and I think he the hair. Oh my god, that haircut! Like it's so cute. I love the green streak, the turquoise streak, the face up. Um, I don't know what head they they used for him, but um, it looks amazing. Wow, he looks amazing. Like he's serving. He, I, I think he's one of the best dolls from the entire from the entire collection. Um, he's really he's really cute, and then he also has articulation, so it's really cool. He has articulation, which I think most Ken dolls do not have, so that's very cool. Um, yes, and he is the first Ken doll to debut in the barbie extra line so i'm very happy he's here i think he he has a very simple but yet very creative not create but just like a very fun outfit i guess like the print the colors it works very well also the oh my gosh yes the the turquoise hair matches perfectly with the turquoise and the and the outfit so i really love that i think he looks really amazing next we have the winter themed doll and this is basically just the barbie of the uh of the series you know like there's always like one doll in the barbie extra series that looks just like a normal barbie and this is her here she has blonde hair some pink streaks i like the hairdo it's very cute um and she also has a pink theme she's wearing a pink jumpsuit it's like all one piece it's very shimmery and then she has this 
a blue fur coat over the jumpsuit and she's also uh, paired it up with a matching set of boots um, she comes with a lot of accessories again the the luggage looks like a popsicle adorable the sunglasses uh, I, yeah I think she it's really cute because the outfit does read winter themed but it's not like she's wearing a full-on ski outfit you know like she doesn't come with like skis or like a, a snowboard so even though it is very winter themed you could still use a lot of these pieces for different combinations which is amazing and i think um while the face is not exciting you know they always use the same face for barbie i think the hairstyle is really cute like i definitely i think the the the, the, the jumpsuit the one piece in the fur coat it really does well together I think she looks really cute. She's really simple, but I like her a lot. Next up, we have the safari themed doll here. And in this picture, we can see her and the winter themed doll hanging out together. And the safari doll, um, you'll notice the face kind of changes between some pictures. Like the face changes a little bit. Like it's not too noticeable. Like if you don't really look at the face directly it's like you you might not see it but I, so that makes me wonder like which face is going to be the actual you know finalized face that they're going to use for the actual dolls because it does make a difference i feel like but the overall doll gives me victoria justice vibes i think someone mentioned that i i, I saw someone mention that and it, yeah it really does remind me of victoria justice uh it, the face sculpt i don't know what it is the hair as well it just it just looks like her the actress <laughs> uh the actual outfit is also a matching set with the jacket and the pants the print is very cute uh it's kind of shimmery the gold boots are very simple and she has a lot of the other accessories in gold as well to match the boots and the safari hat so cute and she has super long hair you know two-toned um I think again the matching set kind of makes her outfit look more simple but i do think the print really adds a lot of fun to her outfit and the accessories are also really cute as well i think she's not one of my favorites but she still works really well and because she has a lot of pink i will definitely be getting her so and lastly we have probably my favorite i think she's my favorite y'all she is adorable she is the um desert themed one so she's going to coachella basically <laughs> <laughs> oh my god and coachella just happened so it's, it's kind of fitting um she has this beautiful denim jean looking jacket with fringe on the sleeves she has a flower crown she has what seems to be like a matching uh top and shorts underneath the jacket and then she's wearing these these really tall boots that are flat they kind of remind me of the um other big chunky boots we just saw earlier in the latest release of barbie extra with the like the alien girl like she has like um like an alien purse like her her boots very similar to these boots right here but these are translucent which are so fun that's such, such a fun uh, little you know detail I, I love translucent shoes it's so it's you know it's so, so it's just so fun um they look like gummy bears and uh i think she just works really well also the face up the again i don't know what head mold is being used here but the actual face screening and the hair uh, is so adorable. And she also comes with a huge ass bag. So huge. It's like a really big bag. But I think, yeah, she's my favorite. She's so cute. I just, I can't. Like, I love the hair. I love the, I love the expression, especially. And I just love the French jacket. Like, how can I not? <laughs> Moving on to the minis. Barbie Extra Fly minis. First up, we have the beach themed one here. Because they're all so themed after the same locations like the regular size dolls. Uh, she's wearing a cute little visor sunglasses some tropical leaf looking uh, earrings she's wearing a two-piece bathing suit underneath of the little skirt piece that you can remove and she's she also has some sandals on i think she's really cute i like the pigtails um she's probably like one of my favorites but she's she's not my favorite like i will get to my favorite favorite in a second because she oh my god yeah yeah so um but she's also really cute i i do think i like the color palette what they gave her it's very unique i think we haven't seen it yet so. next we have the desert themed wait i think she's desert yeah she's desert themed because she also has a fringe <laughs> it matches the regular size barbie doll perfectly she also has this vibrant red pink hair the headband with the hearts she has a dress underneath a lot of fringe as well the cowboy boots i think like i get the concept here but the all of these colors are just kind of like too much for me personally um also the artwork on the packaging here is different they're now doing the same artwork style like on the new barbie fashionistas packaging so that's a very 
interesting as well. Up next, we have the winter, uh, I guess, snow themed doll. And she, I think, is the most co cohesive and most um, straightforward, but in a good sense. Like, she, she has a dress on, she has a coat on, boots, hat, and that's it. Like, I, I, I like the simplicity here. Like, I feel like with the last one, it's too complex. Like, it's too many pieces, too many colors, too many different designs and concepts going, concepts going on here. Uh, but it, with this one, I feel like it just works better. It's just more it's cohesive. It where it's simple. It's not too complicated. It's like a simple dress. Nice materials. Like it shines the shimmery uh, the, the the jacket with the silver metallic finish. Like I think that looks cute. I like the hat. I like the hair. The snow goggles or whatever. Uh, the boots. Um, and also on the artwork, she has different eyes. She has blue eyes, and on the actual doll, she has brown eyes. So they changed that last second. I'm guessing. But she's yeah, she's definitely really cute. And lastly, we have my favorite. Yeah, so this one's the safari themed one. And look at her. She's such an absolute sweetheart. I love the hair, the gold hair, the tinsel. Yeah, she's, she has tinsel in her hair, which I know a lot of people will not like that. But to me, I don't really care too much. The earrings are cute. The dress. The dress with like the rainbow pattern, a cheetah pattern. And then we have like an open portion at the, on the top where you can see the zebra bralette underneath. Like what? That is amazing. I love that so much. Um, and you would think the two prints would clash, you know, like the zebra print, the cheetah print, but they work. They actually work. Like it's it doesn't it doesn't like it doesn't outdo each other. Like they are perfectly they they match, which is so weird. But I love it so much. And I like the fur color as well on the top and pink. Um, and I like the boots. I love how the boots, the headband and the camera really match and all tie in the pink together. I think she just works so well. She's so cohesive, so simple, but so fun. She's definitely my favorite. Now, next up, we have the Barbie Extra Mini Minis. Oh my God, it never, it never stops. <laughs> First up, here we have the desert themed one. Now, I've first I was like confused because she doesn't really give me desert vibes like she's not giving me Coachella but then I realized okay the hat kind of does the metallic finish on the shirt the, the little you know fanny pack like I guess she does kind of look desert themed like again Coachella kind of vibes so I guess it really it, it kind of makes sense and then here we have the winter themed one like um the snow themed and one I think she's like I don't know if she's my favorite I think she uh, she might be one of my favorites because I just think the whole color scheme with her like the light blue and contrast with her deeper complexion it just it works perfectly it's giving me heavy Robin Sterling vibes I just think she's so beautiful I, I like the hairstyle I like the earmuffs. I like the lipstick. I like the long sweater dress. It's actually like fluffy. The boots. I, yeah, I think she's absolutely adorable and definitely one of my um, favorites for sure. Next, we have the beach themed one. And now her design is very simple. She's wearing a, uh, a one piece bathing suit and it has kind of like a tie dye effect almost. I do like the frilled sleeves, the headband, the pineapple purse, the, uh, the Daisy sun, the Daisy sunglasses, um, and uh, her little flip flops are also very chunky. And, oh, and the crimped hair in lavender. I think she's she's really cute, but she's very simple. Um, and I don't really love how all the colors again seem kind of like mixed. And you know? lastly, here part of the individual releases we have the safari themed mini mini. Uh, I think. Oh my gosh, she is so cute. <laughs> Look at the, look at the zebra prints again. The shirt, the baggy pants. Um, look look at those earrings. Look at that hair. Look at that bucket hat. Look at I mean I mean, girl. Like she is serving. She's like full on swag. Like I just. I can't even like how cute are these mini minis? I I think she's absolutely adorable. She's probably one of my top two favorites. Uh, so I think I think my overall favorite is the winter themed one, the snow themed one, and then I do and then I think like the safari themed one. This one she's my second favorite, and then the other two are kind of like you know tied for third and fourth place. But I think all of the minis mini minis are really cute. They're always really cute, like seriously. And of course we are getting a plain place set as well that is made for the barbie extra mini minis and it does also include an exclusive barbie extra mini mini so that's great for all of us completionists who want to get all of the mini minis but don't want the play sets now we're gonna have to get a plane just to get a mini mini doll so that's amazing <laughs> that's the burden of being a completionist um 
the actual place it looks really cute it does look very reminiscent of prior plane play sets that open up or or like previous omg plane like i think the remix plane looks very similar to this one as well um it opens up um but obviously this one's smaller again for the mini minis but i do think you can see on the box there um they depict a extra mini like regular size mini also being able to fit in the plane so that's really cute that there's like double versatility there um but um i did i just it's very bulky like i hope it's not too big because um i'm not a place of person like i don't have space uh but i don't i feel like the, the actual mini mini the doll looks really cute so it's like oh no she's really cute but like do i want to get a whole place of just for like a mini mini doll like it's just like what do you do <laughs> so um i hate when i do this like include a exclusive doll because that makes you because then you need to buy a whole place just to get a doll but um you know it's a it's a cute place at least it's really cute and it, ho hopefully not too expensive those were all the dolls part of the fly sub theme but we do have some new barbie extra mini minis that are just you know regular mini minis so here we have a five pack of the mini minis now and two of these dolls are exclusive to the five packs that are brand new mini minis but they're exclusive to this five pack set and the other three dolls are were previously sold uh separately which i actually just got myself so i'm kind of frustrated now i should have waited and um gotten this five pack because now i'm gonna get doubles so again it's a struggle but um the two exclusive dolls do look very cute but very simple very basic like i i don't really like how basic they look like i really wish that they would have given them more of a unique theme perhaps to make them look more interesting but you know they're okay they're cute and i just hope this set isn't too expensive and reminder there's also two other mini minis that are going to be sold separately uh sometime they're going to be released sometime soon i have seen a couple of people on youtube already unbox them but i don't think they've been properly released yet because they're not on amazon so i don't think they they are like completely released yet so there's this one in pink and like a blue dress um as you can see from the artwork and the style of the packaging she also still has the older artwork style like from the with the other barbie extra mini minis and barbie extra minis um and then we have this one that has like a rainbow theme with the dress the high ponytail in black with the blue streaks the baby hairs uh, and the huge uh, wedge chunky heels like i love the strappy heels like it's such a moment um and she uh people said that she might be like a perfect pride doll which makes sense for the summer which is really cute so i do think those two uh will be coming out very soon uh, near the end of may perhaps oh my god i just forgot but uh th these two dolls there's still two dolls that were part of the series one launch that haven't been released yet so that's crazy that you know these two the orange visor girl one and then we have the mint and pink cared one uh these two they were part of the promos in the initial uh series one mini minis launch but they were never properly released like on amazon at least i can't find them uh maybe if you live in the u.s you're able to find them in store because i have seen a couple of people maybe like review them but like i don't think they're properly like hitting stores yet so i do hope these two also get released properly because again they're part of series one and series one has been released for a couple of months now so that is weird that they would keep these two specifically uh you know locked <laughs> you know like they, they wouldn't release these two properly so i'm, I'm hoping that you know they do so because i need them <laughs> and that was the video i hope y'all enjoyed leave a like share comment subscribe hit the notification bell if you haven't already so you don't miss out when i post more content like this coming your way daily and keeping you up to date with a little tea you love also consider becoming a member today stay safe be kind i hope this next time stay peachy kisses